Hey, 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 Mike Wrigley, Certified Default Advocate and Distressed Property Expert here for another session of our video blog. Today I want to talk about the recent settlement between the five largest lenders and the, and the state's attorney generals. When the whole story broke, it really sounded like homeowners were going to get, finally get a break. The promise of serious principal reductions and loan modifications is not looking so promising the more we peel back the onion, so to say. With right around 11 million homeowners underwater and upside down in their mortgage, the program that was once thought to help up to a million homeowners now looks like it's really only going to help about 500,000. Now, half a million, that's a big number. But not when you consider it's less than 5% of those who really need the help. The other 95% are right back where they started, owing more on their home than what it's worth, and making a payment twice of what they would if they were renting the same property. To make matters worse, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac, the government-backed GSEs, who own nearly 60% of all mortgages, are not participating in the program. Guys, don't pin your hopes on a government bailing you out. Like most government programs, this one is long on promise and short on results. If you owe more than your home is worth, possibly facing foreclosure, or you're just tired of paying on a house that's worth half of what you owe on it, then and you'll never own, then, then give me a call at the number below and we'll give you a free, no obligation consultation. We'll talk about what all your options are, and then you'll be able to make good choices for you and your family. Call me today. Sleep better tonight. You'll be glad you did. I'll see you soon. Thanks for joining us.